Long Island squirrels are going nuts over an abundance of acorns. The experts say we've got a bumper crop this year. CBS 2's Emily Smith explains why. It's a squirrel's paradise. Thousands of acorns strewn all over campus at Adelphi University on Long Island. School officials even tweeting about it, saying, quote, we've had complaints of falling acorns, and we think we've found the culprit. Be on the lookout. And these things are pretty hard. Like, I yeah. can't even break one. <laughs> I can't break one. On a wooden table. Yeah. As you can see, they, they don't break very easily. I've never heard of any injuries or anything like that happening, right. but I would say we're pretty brave, but we're still standing. Here we are standing under one of the biggest oak trees on Adelphi University campus. Only thing is, we don't see any acorns on the leaves. Looks like they've all fallen. Biology professor Alexander Heil says expect to see plenty more falling from oak trees this season. It's too early to tell scientifically, but it's likely a particularly abundant year for them due to a moderate spring. So rather than being an indicator for how the winter is going to be, like a lot of people probably think, it's actually more a messenger from the past. Like in spring, when you have makes the flowers that eventually will form the acorn. So spring is to blame for this. Or to praise. Carol Mackey isn't praising the clusters of acorns on her pool cover, pointing out there are almost no practical uses for them. Except when I was younger, I learned how to make uh, whistle noises out of them. There's a use. There's maybe one positive. Rick Mackey says he doesn't need to go to the gym anymore after scooping them out of his pool. Taking up maybe 150 at a time and then just pulling that up out of the water and dumping it uh, definitely was a workout. Acorns may be heavy in bunches, but Professor Heil says a few hitting you over the head won't hurt you. Calling this acorn abundance nothing more than a nutty nuisance for us. Bon appetit for squirrels and birds. In Huntington, Emily Smith, CBS 2 News. And the professor says one huge oak tree can drop, get this, 10,000 acorns in a single year. I've noticed them in the neighborhood. Have you? Dogs trying to eat them. <laughs> I don't recommend that. They hurt when they, they hit sure them. They sure sting, right? <laughs> Definitely. I have some